Hi there, this is Sam with Vlog Reader. Today I'm doing a video inspection for a 8-inch uh, cast iron line in the uh, old Macy's building in Spokane, Washington. It'll be 223 North Howard Street in Spokane. Um, we're going to do a video inspection of this line and see what's going on with it. We're testing out the grade right now, so what we're seeing is water floating through the uh, rest of the line and making its way out to the end of the sewer pipe right here. So we're going to stop running that water and we'll start to pull stuff back so we can see how the line has grade. But um, what we were looking at before, um, before we started running the water and all that stuff, it's going to clear up here in a sec um, as the water starts to drain out of the pipe. It's the end of the sewer line. So like I said, we're in 8 inch cast iron and uh, it looks like here's our connection to the sewer line. It does look a little offset um, from the cast iron itself to what looks like concrete. Uh, and it's pretty offset from what I'd say. And we'll go ahead and start pulling back and start taking more of a look at this pipe. So uh, I was called out today to see if we can clear some, uh, you know, we were in a, a clay tile pipe right there. Um, we're going to switch over to cast iron here shortly. We got a pretty large separation in the clay tile right here. I believe this would be 8 inch clay tile as well. Um, there's a crack in the bottom corner of this section and uh, where this clay tile meets right here. Uh, it's pretty separated as well. I'll start to pull it back a little bit more. Right now we are still in clay tile. I'd say this is 8 inch clay tile. So far it's not looking too terrible. Come around another bend. And right here we're going to stop the camera. And uh, what we're looking at is the connection from clay tile to cast iron pipe, the 8 inch cast iron pipe that we were doing our video inspection from. And uh, we'll go ahead and start to pull back and explain some stuff about cast iron. It's normally pretty good. Um, what will happen is like right here what we're looking at if we stop the camera um, and we push forward a little bit, we'll see there is a little bit of a uh, hole inside the cast iron itself where it's just rusted out. So we'll stop our camera right here and pull back. Um, you can see it just kind of divots down and holds a little bit of water. There's some rust debris on the bottom of the pipe, which is going to be towards the uh, top left-hand corner of the screen um, at this specific seam. We'll go ahead and start pulling it back a little bit more. Uh, it's just very rusty on the inside. The bottom of the pipe is looking pretty rough. Um, right here doesn't look so bad. Keep pulling it back. a little separation right there, but nothing major. So far it's looking pretty good. And then right here what we're looking at is just some rust debris sitting in the bottom of the line. Uh, water is starting to make it trench out a little bit in this area. Not seeing any big cracks or anything like that, so that's good. And right here again, we're hitting some more just like rust debris is what it's looking like. And it's uh, really rusty inside this line right now. Looks like we're going around a little turn right there. Yeah, we got a whole bunch of just rust and gravel. Let's stop right here. Um, just a lot of debris sitting in the bottom of this line. Uh, I was called out earlier so I could snake this, but... Honestly, snaking's not the best route with this. It's not going to clean all this stuff out. So we'll keep pulling it back. We just ran water through this pipe, so you can see some still kind of going down the line. It definitely is going downhill, and it has grade. This pipe is just super rough, and it definitely needs to be replaced. Right here, we have a break in the cast iron where it's starting to come up. Um, you can see there's almost just like holes where it was rusted out, and that, that metal is actually bending up. Um, so that's not very good at all. We'll go ahead and keep pulling it back. Yeah, definitely some cracks and holes inside the pipe as we're pulling along. Really rough and rusty on the bottom of the pipe. Looks like we're going around another couple turns right there. And then we got... Uh, well, it looks like more rust debris or gravel. Um, kind of hard to say. I'm leaning towards rust to be personally, but it should be gravel as well. Yeah, it's like the whole pipe is caked in this section. Uh, you can see it kind of even form around our camera. 
and it looks like right here, I believe it's just because of the amount of debris in the line itself, it's actually holding like a little bit of standing water right here, I'd say maybe like a half inch. Um, I don't think this is necessarily back rated, I think that it's just the fact that the line is uh, totally filled with debris in this section, and it's not really letting any of it scoot by as we want to. But, uh, yeah, we were running water through it, and it does look like it, it definitely has grade, so that's good. Um, the cast iron itself is just not in good condition at all. Um, so we're going to be pulling out of our 8-inch cast iron line right now, which is what we're looking at right here. And that's going to conclude our video inspection. Thank you.